So it's time to say goodbye to this wave. It was a complete surprise. One of the most perfect waves I've ever seen in my life. It's just every single one that comes in is so hollow. Um, we didn't expect this at all. We didn't really have any significant swell on the forecast or anything. And we just saw this from the binoculars, what, two days ago. And it's just been awesome ever since definitely paying for it. It's not a user-friendly wave by any means, even though it's pretty perfect. It's super shallow. You hit the reef a lot. It changes a ton throughout the day based on what the tide is doing. Um, but yeah, this was our last little goodbye session. Couldn't be any better. Matt, any last words? I'll be back. Chris? <laughs> I may be back. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, Binaka, thank you for letting us in. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> so this is a little first aid in the tropics. You've probably seen it before, um, people having reef cuts and getting limed. Uh, it actually is super practical and works because I've been scraped up all over my body and have done an experiment where I did you know, iodine on one thing, just peroxide on one, neosporin on the other, and lime on the other. And everything started getting a little infected in three days except for the ones I put lime on. So this does actually work. It doesn't feel great. Um, what you want to do is you want to squeeze it so the juice comes out and that pulp kind of like acts, acts like a toothbrush and really scrubs it out at the same time. So you want to give it a good scrub, getting the citric acid in there, killing all the bugs. And then you wait and then the blood, it usually starts bleeding again. Then the blood turns black because you just made ceviche out of yourself and just cooked it. <laughs> and then that's how you know it worked. Let's see, let's see your back, Mark. Let's see. Do we, I, don't, I haven't even seen if I have cuts on my back yet. Uh, just, just a few. <laughs> my knee. Oh yeah. The, sh the left shoulder is the good tattoo. Is it? Yeah. Great. We all went surfing, Mark got attacked by a cat. <laughs> 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 <And> a liger. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Scrub. Scrub hard, scrub hard. Oh, I'm feeling ones I didn't even know I had. <laughs> <laughs> so far, the lower back ones are the winner, I'm telling you. You get in that booty. Oh. <laughs> it needs to be. That's I've been a bad boy! <laughs> I've been a bad boy! So stoic, Mark. Yeah, seriously. Everything hurts. <laughs> My whole body hurts. <laughs> Don't forget the leg. You want more scrubbing, Mark? 
Chris, you're liking this too much. One more time. One, two, three. Wait, wait, wait. I gotta get in the video with you guys, okay? We'll do it one more time, one more time. One, two, three. All right, so we've been island hopping on the boat. Um, surfed an awesome right really special place that we did not um, have really targeted to be honest um, it kind of surprised us got our fill of that had to come and do a boat repair and switch to another area and now we're on the left it looks uh, like it's got some bit of wall on it like four to six probably and I'm gonna try to bust out my twin fin I got a carbon wrap 5-2 uh, 20 my WRB, Ron Meek shaped it, and um, I've only used it in really crummy waves so far, and it feels like it can be pushed a bit. So I'm gonna give that a go and um, see if it handles. If not, I'm gonna come back to the boat and grab a 510 or a 60, kind of traditional style board. But uh, another beautiful morning in Fiji. Can't complain. <laughs>
How's the session? Glorious. Lots of long, long tubes. I'm so glad I took this 5.2 uh, twin fin out because I think it's the best or my favorite tube riding board I've ever ridden in my life. It's like being in a Tesla or something. Like you can just turn on speed and cover so much ground so fast and it's so short that you can fit it into pockets if you have to like kick stall and readjust. But uh, this thing is amazing. Thank you, WRV Ron Meeks. I saw Mark clearing 20 foot seconds from that thing. <laughs> this Fully is... disappearing, massive pumps, reappearing, disappearing, reappearing. And it, it does good off the foam ball too. Like it just, it handles, it doesn't get squirrely. That could be a foil board. It could be. <laughs> yeah, it looks like my foil board. 